guys, welcome to another episode of Australian Stock Photos. This weekend we decided we would head up to the Broken River National Park campgrounds, which is about 80 kilometres west of Mackay and then 5 kilometres west of Yungla. The cost for the campgrounds was about $6.75 and needs to be booked with National Parks online before you arrive. There is only 8 campsites at this campground so you would need to book fairly early. Remember that there is a range that you need to climb up between Finch Hatton and Yungla. It's fairly steep, so if you're taking caravans up there, take that into consideration. The campgrounds are situated right on the banks of Broken River, which has platypus viewing both directions on well-constructed paths. We had absolutely no trouble finding platypus. We must have seen five or six of them. They were in the river pretty much all day. Cute little devils. We did find the best viewing for the platypus was from the bridge crossing the river. There's also a nice little cafe there that you can get coffee and cake. From there we went for a drive out to Yungala Dam. There were people there camping on the sides of the bank of the dam. Probably we'll head back there one day and camp on the side of the bank. Looked like good fishing. I had downloaded a list of full day drives off the National Parks website before, I, before we left. And we headed off down Cockle Creek Road to another campgrounds that was about 15 or 16 k's in. This road you probably wouldn't attempt in wet weather. It was fairly boggy. It was beautiful, went up along the top of the range, up through the rainforest. We ended up not getting right out to the campgrounds and pulled up and had some lunch and then drove back into town. Next morning we got up, went for a drive down into Finch Hatton and around that area and um, up into the Finch Hatton Gorge for the afternoon. It's a 2.8k hike in and out return trip into the gorge. Beautiful swimming hole walks right through the rainforest it is uphill going in and downhill coming back out again so you're doing your hard slog going in pulled into a little side track where we saw a coal train going over the river it was very pretty be a nice swimming hole in summer i would say Then we were off to collect some firewood to make campfire for the night. It was freezing up there. I think the first night was like four degrees, second night was six, third night was nine. So that's it for us. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you're heading up to Broken River, that'll give you a bit of an insight. Thank you.